Georgian and American chaplains have come together in Dalaram to celebrate Christmas. The Georgian Orthodox Church, recognizing the Julian calendar, observes the holiday about two weeks after many other Christian groups. It is a uh, privilege to serve with a coalition partner, uh, such as the Georgians have been. Uh, or the, the same service or variation of it uh, in Baghdad at Camp Victory, where Georgians were present in 2005. Uh, and here I am again, uh, uh, six years later, uh, uh, serving with them again. Over the last few months, soldiers of the 32nd Georgian Battalion and U.S. Marines have united with Afghan security forces in Nimruz province. Their mission to provide peace and security for the Afghan people has brought them closer. This worship service is just one example of that continued partnership, but for the Georgians, it represents something more. The fall of communism in 1991 uh, and the independence of the former Soviet republics allowed them to re-engage in the chaplaincy to reestablish the chaplaincies that had existed in Imperial Russian times uh, but ceased to exist under the official atheistic policies of the Soviet Union. So it's, it's indeed a, a, a privilege to uh, work with them but also a, a, personal, um, a personal joy to uh, celebrate the, the resurrection of something like their uh, chaplaincy. As that partnership continues, Georgians and Marines can be found throughout the province promoting peace with their Afghan brothers. Sergeant Dean Davis, Delaram, Afghanistan.